you still need progressive overload. So you could do pull-ups and push-ups. You'll build muscle to an extent, uh, but definitely not as much as if you had equipment. My God, we got a lot of questions about home equipment. This one's from Chris D 89 on Instagram. And remember, if you're watching live, drop that in the comments below. Hashtag ask Papa Solio. I can, uh, Papa Solio, can I build muscle at home without any equipment? I can no longer afford my gym membership. Um, can I build muscle at home without any equipment? Yes. You still need progressive overload. So you could do pull-ups and push-ups. You'll build muscle to an extent, uh, but definitely not as much as if you had equipment. So you could purchase some stuff at home, maybe get something used. You could maybe get a tire to flip. I don't know if you have a home or an apartment. Maybe you don't have room to flip a tire, but you can get maybe a free tire and flip that in the back of your house. You can get a pull-up bar. You can tie jugs of water around your waist or hold it between your legs. You can maybe have someone sit on your back for push-ups. You could do one-arm push-ups. You can definitely overload your body a lot with body weight, but it's going to come to a point where you just need extra resistance. So for example, for legs, you could do sprints. You could do hill sprints. You could do plyometrics. You could do high rep stuff. But in terms of building mass, there's nothing that actually replaces the overload um, available with weights. So can you do it with body weight? Sure. It's just going to be harder to add that overload because, you know, if you pick up dumbbells, you can definitely go up incrementally and do that in a proper way. If you're only doing stuff at home, it's going to be harder to maybe get the angle proper or get exactly the overload that you need. That would be the proper progression to build muscle. It's just hard to, to do that, but you can do it with water jugs. You can do it with car parts. There's lots of different hacks. You can tie, tie strings around stacks of books. It might not be glamorous, but you can definitely do it. I would definitely recommend getting some bands or some stuff at home. If you're able to scrape that together or find some used or free weights or go to a tag sale or a, you know, a yard sale. A lot of people sell really cheap workout equipment. It's kind of hard to find cheap stuff now just because steel prices and everything is going up. A lot of times the resale value of weight equipment is a little bit overpriced, but you can definitely make a lot of stuff yourself. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good point. You see those stuff on TikTok and YouTube. Uh, Matthew says, if you want to be inspired, look up the guys in third world countries who make their own equipment, have scrap metal and stuff and get swole. It's true.